Hello everyone, welcome to the stream. Uh, here we are with the original Bayonetta again. Uh, I just got home and I realized that, wait, I haven't actually streamed real gameplay footage tonight. So I thought like, eh, I might as well get on that. But unfortunately, as it turns out, I have to do this thing again and again and again. Oh shit. Oops. I think, um, I think removing... Yeah, what? Okay, maybe... Little Devils. Which time will be instantly triggered? Uh, Vitality. None of this seems all that... useful. I guess we'll just put in the Moon Mahakala, because... I don't like the accessories in this game. They're all like... I don't want to call them useless, but I don't care for using any of them. So we got shit. Jo dodging all the time, just... Okay, here we go. So dodging the green blast doesn't help you... Alright, shit. It doesn't help you trigger witch time? Like, what? Okay. This is so boring to play through. It really is. Alright. I'm thinking I uh, should probably just quit right here. Oops, it's over. I can't beat this. It's too uh, It's too boring. It's not the difficulty. It's actually pretty straightforward, but it, it's boring. Here we go. I guess if you get... Hang on. If you equipped... Let's see. Eternal Testimony. Yeah, would you get a higher score with this? Oops. Equipped it. Yeah, let's see here. Enemies are supposed to become way more aggressive with this on, so... Yeah, I was watching an uh, anime earlier today, and I was having a blast, but unfortunately I was interrupted. I was watching... I was read, I was watching My Hero Academia, working on my book, Rabbit Hole, which has uh, hit a new milestone, by the way. And uh, I was interrupted and had to go do something, and I'm so, so frustrated by that, because I was doing so, so well, and now I think I kind of, uh, it broke my flow, so to speak. Uh, I'll probably do it, get back to it tonight, but, oof. It's so frustrating whenever that happens, it really is. Um, Here we go, dodge. Yeah, I, I tried to look up a guide for this, but I couldn't find a single thing that actually gave me a good strategy on how to do this. Cause like, so I, I think I am just gonna have to wing it. Unfortunately, oh, here we go. Oops, what the fuck? Yeah, because they're triggered, oh no. Yeah, they fight a little bit differently. Because I'm wearing the Gaze of Despair. Alright. It does give you a lot more Halos, though, so I think it would be, uh... I think it is worthwhile to have it on. I believe it improved your combo score, too, but... Uh, we'll have to see. Oops. This game is so good for the most part. Like, I... I cannot wait until I platinum these chapters and never have to play them again, because I am I am so frustrated with this. I am so done with it. <sighs> yeah, I legit think that, like, after I uh, platinum this, I don't think I'll ever play this again. Oops. Uh, play this uh, level again. The rest of the game is great, but this is just awful. Oops. Oh, wow. Easy peasy. Okay, gold medal. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Combo time. Good, good. Okay, so I think having the Gaze of Despair is all you need. Alright, so you should be able to do it. Alright. If that's all we need to do, I think we're golden. 
I would have gotten a platinum if I didn't got hit so much. And that was just me being careless. And the level being awful, but... Yeah, I think if I get a gold here, a gold there, and then a platinum on Gene, I should be fine. I don't know. Shit, do I really have to platinum them both? Well, a little bit more practice, and I think I will have it. And then from there on, I then on, I'll be able to uh, deal with it Oops, as it comes. Here we go. The fuck? Oh, here we go. Shit. Oh, damn. Yeah, I'm so used to them, like, tripping with the, that attack. Uh, I, I guess I'm not used to how the, um, the enraged ones behave. Because they do act a little bit differently. They are way, way more aggressive. I actually don't even know how to taunt in this game. I never actually bothered to do it. I'm not even sure what it does. I think it raises your score a little bit, but I just, I just fight the game. I don't care. Like, I don't use the taunt button. Like, why the fuck would I do that? I think it's, like, click the left stick, right? Is that it? Oh, here we go. I mean, we have... This is a rocket, so we're, uh... It's a missile, so we have to be going at least, like, 200 miles an hour. How fast the missiles go? They have to be pretty fast. I actually don't know. and It has to be 200 miles, right? Here we go. Yeah, that's, uh, it's getting more bearable, actually. Now that I'm, a uh, oh, well, to be fair, this is not quite the one I had in mind. Oh, It's not the end of the verse, but, uh, I think that we're almost to the end already, so I, I guess, like, yeah, I, I think I'm getting used to it, honestly. It's not nearly as bad as I remember it. I mean, I, I guess I do tend to avoid this level for good reason, but uh, I am getting used to it. It's going faster, and I'm getting higher scores, so. Oops, here we go. I'm not getting hit nearly as much. Yeah, triggering witch time slows it down a lot, so that might be it. I might just be, might have just been a triggering witch time all the time rather than just dodging the things. The Bayonetta 2 one is a lot better, I think. Not to mention a lot a lot easier to do. The, the, the really frustrating thing about the Bayonetta 2 one, though, if you use the Star Fox one, it, it's basically impossible to get a uh, uh, a Platinum because of how it works. Like, you have to uh, to use the standard gameplay. Like, I, I kept using the Star Fox one trying to do it for the longest time, but uh, because of the, the way the Star Fox one works, like, I don't remember exactly what it is. It, it doesn't work, so you have, you have to use the standard which is uh, kind of frustrating. Right. How far away is it? Alright, and then you suddenly get there. Uh... Oops, here we go. Fuck. Um... Oh yeah, this is still better than on DMZ5, by the way. Alright. <laughs> yeah, all the bitching I made about this. Yeah, it's still better than Devil May Cry, which is a shit. Okay. Oops. Oh, shit. Oops. Alright, let's get this down. After this, we'll have a uh, gene. Oops, there we go. Shit. Wait. Fuck. 
definitely not the uh, most fun segment in the world. Uh, here we go. Like, there's no way to kill him quickly. Like, I just want to kill this guy dead, but... Oh, fuck. Okay, here we go. Ah, well, at least it's over now. Hopefully that's good enough, but... I doubt it. Uh, I think I... I think I'm gonna get a gold. I think I did get better, but... Oh, fuck. Uh... Yeah, if I could just stop getting hit so much, and it's really just because it goes on so long, it's not exactly hard. There we go. So, yeah, I got gold on both of them. It, it was the damage both times. Ugh. It's always the damage. Like, I get, I just get careless. All right. I mean, I, I guess, like, it's really frustrating when, like, you, uh... I mean, if you know what you're doing, you're always going to get a good time. And, um, combos are pretty easily correctable. So I guess, I guess it is mostly just damage for me. All right, here we go. Oh, fuck. Dodge that. Oops. I'm pressing buttons. Why aren't I beating Eugene? Ah, oh, we've got fuck. Ah, fuck. Oh, is it because I have the Gaze of Despair uh, equipped? It? Is, is that why she's harder? Oops, here we go. Yeah, I'm getting destroyed out here. Um, yeah, I'm not platinum in, the, platinum in this shit. Oops, here we go. Yeah, I'm getting destroyed out here. Oh, here we go. Uh, yeah, should I unequip the uh, the gaze of despair for the actual fight? Just so uh, I don't get murdered. Uh, yeah, maybe I should uh, reset the fight. Just let's see. Yeah, I wasn't expecting the Gaze of Despair to make her that, that much harder. Well, I mean, I, I thought about it, but I was like, eh, let's give it a shot first. Alright, uh, change it back. Alright, here we go. Yeah, okay, basic bitch gene, you're going down. Yeah, much easier. Here we go. That's uh, quite the difference. Oh, fuck, what the... Man, I couldn't see what she was doing for a minute there. I was like, wait, what the fuck was that? Alright. What the fuck was that? She has so many wicked weaves that you yourself can't do. It's like, it's biz it's bizarre when she throws out shit that you can't do. Alright, um... Alright. Oops, yeah, let's get the cutscene. I don't care. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, oops, yeah, I gotta... I really gotta learn how to counter the missiles. There we go. Ah, oh, damn! I, I pressed the button too soon. I knew it was coming, but I just... Okay. The missiles aren't that hard to avoid, dude. Okay, here we go. Yeah, it's so easy to avoid. Okay. Here we go. I love how you do that. You would, Everyone always just immediately just runs at them with the panther. It's so cool. This is so much better than, like, anything in Bayonetta 2. It really is. Like, this one sequence alone is, like, better than, like, all of Bayonetta 2. I'm not even, like, kidding. Right, here we go. I don't know. I'm kind of feeling, like, a costume change for Bayonetta as an order. I think. I'm kind of ready for a costume change. Right, here we go. Fuck. Oops. All right, here we go. Yeah, what should I wear next? Uh, I don't know what costume I want. I think I have them all, at least most of them. Uh, yeah, bitch. All right. Uh, what? Fuck. Wait. Okay, I should not be getting smacked around. That. I, th I think our my damage score is already shit. But right, here we go. Is that how you win? Like, just start pressing the button before the, uh, the thing pops up? Oh shit, I got destroyed. All right.
There we go. All right, final phase. Didn't have to press the button that time. All right. I mean, it's such a gorgeous fight place to fight. Like, I just, I just love design of it. It's not really explained like what this place is, but it's just, oh, I love it so much. It's such a beautiful city. Like, you really do like appreciate like all the work and effort they put into like this level design. It's legit like one of my favorite areas in video games ever. I named my town in uh, Animal Crossing after it. Big Grid. Um, I don't, I don't know if I've uh, confirmed that on stream or not. Here we go. Definitely one of my uh, favorite video game locations. I would totally go here if it was real. Oops. Oh, here we go. I mean, I guess it's based on like actual European cities, but yeah, European cities are so much more interesting than American cities. That's like the only thing I'll, I'll give like European European society. That's mostly because of like the history, though. It's not because of anything they're doing differently. Like, other countries are crap, but... Complete shit, but, uh... Okay, here we go. Punch, punch, punch. Uh -huh. That got her, bitch. All right. Up. All right, we got it. What do we get? Gold. Ah, fuck. So gold all the way through. Like gold all the way through. But uh, because of all the damage we took, okay, I, I think I can definitely platinum it. I think I can definitely do. It takes 20 minutes for me to do that. Fucking really? 20 minutes a pop? Are you serious? Ah. Uh, well, to be fair, I think uh, now that I know what I'm doing, I think I'll be able to do it no problem. I just gotta not take the hits. I just gotta. Uh, dodge. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll cheat if uh, I have to, but... Well, cheating. Not really cheating, uh, just reloading if I need to. It shouldn't be too difficult, actually. Uh, I hate this stage so much. I hate it so much, it's so boring. All right. Like, honestly, like I don't like the, uh, the end of the game nearly as much as I like the first half. Like, um, Father Balder is kind of disappointing. I'm not a big fan of Jubilees. Uh... Chapter 15 feels like it goes on too long. Like, I, again, like these are just minor complaints. But uh, all right, let's uh, let's look at my costumes. I am uh, getting sick and tired of this. Uh, this I don't even know what it is. Like, it had like Platinum Games logo on it, so that's why I was. Uh, yeah, that's exactly why I was wearing it. Uh, no other reason. Uh, it, it has Platinum Games logo on it, but I don't remember what it was. Okay, hang on. Where's my costumes? Here we go. Here we go. Uh, change costumes. A bodysuit set for the woman who wants to experience different facets of herself. What the fuck does that even mean? Old. Uh. Umbra. Non. Queen. Queen of the Witches. Umbra. Komachi? The Ark. That's for G. That's for Jean. Uh. Uh. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll try the kimono. I'm a big fan of uh, girls with kimono kimonos. So. Uh, let's see here. Wait, hang on. Can I equip? No shit. Yeah, I'll have to. I'll have to do it when I start. All right. Unfortunately. Unfortunately, I'm just gonna have to start it. All right. Okay, I'm gonna have to start the level. Equip the gaze of despair. That's Selene's light. What am I doing? Where's the gaze of the spirit? Is this it? Yeah, here it is. Yeah, they don't look all that different, but yeah, they're completely different powers. Okay. Yeah, with the gaze of the spare equipped, it, I should be able to uh, make the points I need to become make platinums and keep going. Now I just need to not take the hits. So I guess we'll just reload if we don't get a platinum here. Um, all right. There's only three verses here, so there's not much room for error either. It's like it's just an, an annoying chapter all around. All right. Uh, 
Yeah, honestly, like, I think I could probably uh, platinum it all tonight. Like, um, Balder is not going to be hard. Um, Jubileus, I think, might be a little bit hard, but we'll see. Honestly, like, honestly, at this point, like, my big problem with Jubileus, I, I can't... I can't punch her into the sun properly. I don't know what it is, but I keep fucking up, like, that final thing where you have to punch her into the sun. Like, I just... I, I, I can't... I, I can't do it for some reason. I, I don't know. Like, I don't know if, like, I'm just stupid or doing it wrong. Uh, like, the past couple of times I've done it, it's, like, it's gone badly. And, I, and I've really gotten bad scores as a result. Like, I think I had, like, a perfect run, basically, when I last did it. Uh, for the silvers. When I was going for all silvers. And, uh... I think I just fucked it up, like, twice, and I was just like, wow. And it's such a long fight, too, it's really difficult to justify uh, replaying it ever. Here we go. Here we go, fucker. I murdered that guy, shit. So yeah, 100% in this game has been an absolute treat. I would highly, highly recommend it to any uh, action game fan. Like, yeah, it has its tedious parts like this, but it's still like a 10 out of 10. Like, it's still, like it's like 100 hours long. Like, what 100 hour long game isn't like tedious at least a, a couple of times? It's just, I don't know, it's just the nature of 100 hour long games, I suppose. Oops, here we go. Here we go. Here we go, yep, here they come. Bitches. Here we go. Jam! I, I dodged! Okay. I pressed the button. Alright. I pressed the dodge button, man. Alright. I swear if I don't have the um, the thing I need, uh, we are definitely restarting. If I don't get a platinum, we are um, turning it off and restarting it. Oops, here we go. Well, I shouldn't have gotten hit. Like, that's the thing. Like, it was just... It just sort of happened. Like, ugh, whatever. Yeah, you need to, like, not barrel roll. I think I do need to shoot them a bit more. Okay, here we go. Boss time. Uh, let's see how we do. Uh... Okay, let's see. Yep, okay, reset. Okay, gold is not good enough. Uh, we're going for platinums. We are going for platinums. Like, I don't want to... I'm not fucking around. I'm not, like... I'm not playing. I, I want a pure platinum. All right. Well, it doesn't need to be a pure platinum, but... Wait, was it already equipped? It? Oh, wow. Okay, shit. Wait, no. Fuck, wait. There we go, alright. I don't know why you would ever have anything other than Eternal Testimony and the Moon of Mahakala, like, ever equipped it. Like, they're too good. Like, everything else is just gimmicky. It's just, alright. So, okay, the only thing I need to do, the only thing I had to do there, I did everything perfectly, I just took too many hits. Like, that's it. It's just so frustrating. Uh, alright. Okay, I just, oh shit, alright. That's a hit, that's not good. There goes my uh, platinum, I think. Honestly, like, if I get a gold uh, in damage, I should be fine, but... And I guess I, I guess I need to practice the entire run. Like, just getting tapped shouldn't... Shouldn't kill it for me. Like, honestly, I think it was those guys who, uh... Who jumped me on the, uh... On the missile top. Who, uh, came down and, and attacked, alright. All right. Got him. Oh, bitch. What, did that hit me? No, it didn't. It felt like it did, but no, it didn't. Da-da-da-da. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Got me. Fuck. There's too many of them. All right. I just want to avoid the attacks. All right. Yeah, here we go. Here comes the dragon. 
Oh, here we go. Wait. Got him, bitch. Okay, uh, a little bit longer. Okay, we're about halfway through verse one, I would say. Yeah, there's like a mid-boss, and then there's a boss, and then like you get the verse. So uh, we gotta do this twice. We gotta get platinum twice. Um, if we don't manage it, we're gonna have to uh, keep doing it over and over again until we do it. Oops. Alright. Yeah, it start like, 20 minutes for the entire chapter, really. This segment goes on so long. Like, it has to be, like, at least 10 minutes long, right? And then the boss fight is, like, 10 minutes. Honestly, like, this segment feels longer than the actual boss fight. Which is ridiculous. Like, wh okay, cut this level out entirely. Just have it be a boss fight, and the game would be perfect. You don't need this bullshit. All right. Like, you don't need a bullshit stage. Wait, what the fuck? Where did that come from? Where the fuck did that come from? Why didn't I get that, like... Where did that heart come from? I don't understand where that heart came from. Okay. So what other hearts have I missed? I actually have no idea. They're, are they just randomly strewn throughout the levels? Like, uh... Yeah, I have no idea what, what that thing was. Like, uh, Like, it just randomly popped out of nowhere, and I'm kind of confused as to why. Uh... uh like, those are heart containers, so it's like, okay, what, why is it here? All right. Oh, shit. Yeah, we got smacked again. All right. Let's see how, uh, yeah, this is the boss. Ah, oh, damn, we got shot again. All right, let's see, it's, uh... Oh, fuck! Yeah, I got hit twice. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, okay, we got it, we got it. We got the platinum, all right. Um, could've gotten a pure platinum, but whatever. Not a big deal, I will just... We're just going for platinums now, um... Da, da, da. Oh damn, brutal. Yeah, fuck you, you piece of shit. All right. The hack and slash your way through victory. Oh man, I love the way she holds the sword when she's using, when she's uh, wearing this. So I, I'm a big fan of uh, I'm a big fan of the kimono. I love that kind of uh, samurai shit. Oops. Female samurai shit, which is a uh, you know not a real thing, but I love it anyway. All right. longer. Alright. Yeah, we got the platinum the first time, and we haven't gotten touched this time. We, I might get a pure platinum then, now, and I might be able to get away with a gold on uh, Jean. Actually, if, like, if, as long as I don't get touched, I should be fine against Jean. So let, let's see how that goes. Uh, here we go. Oh, shit, I forgot about the... Here we go. Did I get him? Oh, fuck. Did we get him? Oh, fuck. Uh, I thought we were near the end, but we're like halfway through verse 2. Like, what the fuck? 
Oh, we're not even. We're technically not even halfway through first two, but alright, here we go. Fuck. Here we go. Okay, we're gonna dodge these and then. Oh fuck. Yeah, timing was off. Uh, hopefully that doesn't hurt my time too much. You could. I couldn't even see them coming. Really, I just sort of guessed when they would come, get here. All right, here we go. All right, now let's build up my magic and uh, prepare for the boss. Hopefully we did well enough. Hopefully we're gonna get. Oh shit. Okay. Nope. I got hit. We're fucked. That would uh, ruin my perfect, my pure platinum run right there. I'm just, I legit thought I was gonna do it for a minute there. I get a pure platinum on this verse, but I won't. Not a big deal. Um, I think as long as I get gold on Gene, I, I should be able to to get what I want. Because I'm not going for pure platinums. That's just that's just crazy. I'm just just regular old platinums for the achievement. Um, that's all I really want. Um, oops. Here we go. Shit. Okay, here we go. Oh, here we go. Shit. There. Alright. Come on, after this... Okay, to know the truth, do we, do we have what it takes to uh, get a platinum on uh, both of these stages? Oh, fuck. Come on, come on, kill him, kill him. Die, die, die. Uh, got him, okay. We got it, we got it. We got it. Holy shit, we did it. Oh, yep, we got the we got the achievement. Oh, yes. We got the achievement. I wasn't even going for the achievement. I was mostly concerned about the platinum for the overall stage, but uh, I knew the achievement was a thing, and um, very, very glad I got it. Oof, all right. Oh, fuck. So I think as long as I get a reasonably good score here... Oh, fuck. I need to... I forgot to uh, unequip the thing. All right. It took so long, I completely forgot about that. All right. Yeah, that's, that's such an overpowered combo. I don't use it nearly enough. Well, it's a, it's a good combo against Gene, I should say. I mean, you're using, like, two Wicked Weaves in conjunction, so of course it's awesome. Alright, here we go. Oops, here we go. Oh, whoops, yeah, we gotta wait for this to, to pass. Again? Okay. Uh, the missile comes down quick, quickly. I responded. All right. Oh, you started at the beginning. All right. Okay, hang on. Let's uh, might as well take full advantage of this. Uh, yeah, I really hate this stage. Uh, oops, we got fuck. 
Hot damn, I am uh, really fucking this up. Alright. Okay, let's see how this goes. Okay. Yeah, pulling off a really successful moon in Mahakala is so satisfying. Alright, here you go. I'm like responding with the QTEs before I even see them. I'm just like, oops, did I get it? Yeah. Damn, what the fuck? Okay. This fight is so good, dude. I'm having so much fun with this. Alright, here we go. Wait, did I see the Platinum logo up there? Wow, that's their building? They have an office on Big Red? Alright. Alright, I think I got it. Alright. I think if I just get through here... Yeah, the Moon of Mahakala is really useful against it. Which here we go. Yeah, I don't think I got a platinum, but I think I managed to ma to eke out a gold. My times and combos are fine, so. Gene, you suck. You're you're gone. Oh, what? We hit each other? Wow. The oh, fuck? My button. I thought it was a kick. Okay. Oh damn, she got me. All right. Yeah, probably because I pressed the wrong button before. Yeah. And not an easy fight, for sure. Alright. Yeah, I'm not sure if I managed to get a gold or not. Ah, oh, shit! She got me again! Alright. This bitch! Alright. Can't beat her. She's too fast. All right. She's too powerful. All right. She keeps dodging on my decks. All right. Shit, you bitch. All right. Got her. Yeah, I think this took a bit, tad bit too long. Okay. 
I think we're good. Yeah, damn, took too much damage. Okay, I think I got it. Two platinums and a gold. That should be platinum, right? If I got all platinums, it'd be pure platinum, but I don't I don't care for that. Yep, I killed Jean. I killed my uh I killed my friend, my Umbran sister. Okay, what did I get? Yep, we're set. Alright, now we only have uh three chapters to go. You should have been a pole down so yeah, sure, whatever. I'm sure there are a bunch of Bayonetta cosplayers willing to uh, to do that. You know what? You know what? I I've never actually seen a really good Bayonetta cosplayer. I, I don't know what it is. Ugh. I don't know, man. I, I think I need to go to one of these events next year and uh, scope things out, if you uh, catch what I'm saying. There's got to be one now that she's in Smash. Like, a really, really good one. I don't know. I don't get why they, like, they cos people cosplay, like, really obscure characters and not fucking Bayonetta. Is it because she's too hard? Is she, is she too sexy? All right. Like, shit, that's never stopped thoughts before, but okay. Uh, play history? All right. Yep, yeah, okay. So we have, uh, yep, we have, um, yeah, we have platinums overall, but I want to get platinums for everything here. So that means, uh, yeah, 15 we need to improve, and the boss fights we need to improve. Uh, Balder, I think, is going to be easy as fuck, but uh, I'm, not, I'm not quite so sure about how um, everything else is going to go. This is uh, this in particular is going to be ridiculous. Here we go. Oops. Might as well kill this guy. Yeah, Jubileus, I think... Does Jubileus, do Jubileus have multiple verses? I think, like, you have the verse one where you're climbing up with Gene, and then you have, like, the second. I think that was the, the problem I had when I, I went for it. I, I don't think it's that hard to platinum it, but... Um, I, I think there are multiple verses, and, like, that first one is kind of gimmicky. Uh, here we go, platinum metal, awesome. And the combo could have been a bit better, but, eh, platinum is a platinum. Alright, um, verse 1. I don't know where all the, uh, I don't know where the portals are, though. I probably should bring up a, um, a, um, a guide, because I don't know where all the Alfine portals are. I think I'm, like, I think the ones in this level are probably the last ones in the entire game, but we'll see. Oh, shit. I hate these things, like, just, why, why are fire enemies a thing? Oh, whoops. Shit, hang on. You gotta slow down time to beat them? Like, what the fuck is that shit? Alright. Just let me hit them like anyone else, any, anything else. And then, like... I think they're easier to deal with, like, with, uh... On higher difficulties, because, like, you can just get witch time off them easier, but... Oops. Oh, fuck. Are you serious? What the fuck? Alright, we're just gonna shoot you, bastard. He's just standing there, like, getting angry. Like, what a piece of shit. All right. Okay, what was that? That was embarrassing. There's no way that... Gold? Yeah, my combo could have been better. Well, if they weren't on fire... All right, well, I, I think we're just going through a run-through here to make sure we have everything. Uh, make sure we know where everything is. Uh... Yeah, verse 3. Yep, more of them come in. Oh, shit. Since when did these things get those so fast? Well, anyway. Yep, and they, they do... <laughs> and they do a thing where they do a fusion dance and they become a big one. The Holy Trinity, you could say. Oh, here we go. And they're so quick, you can't even kill them all before they fuse. Like, I think I killed the first one, and then another one just spawned. So I think this thing, like, spawns no matter what you do. Which I guess makes sense, but... Alright, here we go. Alright. This game is so satisfying to get good at. It really is. Alright, how did that go? Uh, what did I get there? Pfft. 
platinum. Yeah, so I got a platinum, a, a gold, and a platinum. This is going very well. The only issue I think I'm going to have is if I uh, accidentally miss an Alfheim or a hidden burst or something. Yeah, what is this? First four, yep. Yeah, I'll kill this fucker real quick. Uh, kill his buddy. Yeah, fuck Gracious and Glorious. I usually skip these ones on uh, standard playthroughs because I just can't stand fighting these fucks. Alright. I mean, I, I guess I've gotten better at them, especially on normal, but I think on Infinite Climax they get really, really unbearable. Uh, here we go. Well, I, I guess I've beaten Infinite Climax. I, I don't know. It's, it's been a while since I've played Infinite Climax, so maybe I'm kind of uh, underestimating, my own, underestimating my own skill, but uh, I remember them being really hard. Here we go. Here we go. Shit. Hey, the Moon of Mahakala is super OP. All right. Yeah, Platinum. Holy shit. Yeah. Hey, let me make sure I'm getting... Yeah, I'm, I'm getting everything good. Uh, I'm getting. I'm doing all the things I'm supposed to do, but I don't know if I, I'm getting all the uh, Bayonetta Chapter 15 verses. So wh which one was that? Four? Yeah. So we are. Um, no IGN. No fuck you IGN. I want the Bayonetta wiki. Here we go. Yeah, the Bayonetta wiki is so good at this kind of thing, because it's so good at, like, just being quick and... Verse 4, optional. Okay, verse 5. Proceed through the door, and you will face a pair of joy. Alright. Whatever. Uh. Like, you don't need, like, pictures. Like, you just need, like... A general idea what you're supposed to be doing. Ah, oh, fuck. Yep. Okay, let's see how'd that go. I probably didn't go as quickly as I could have. I mean, I guess a gold is acceptable. I've gotten, like, several platinums already. Oh, Platinum, shit! I'm really, really doing well. Alright, uh... Alright, where is the six? Once you go to the door and head up the stairs. Alright, uh... Oh, shit. Yeah, so I think I um I think I have the first half of this down. Like the issue I think I, I'm gonna have with this, it's so fucking long. Like this is a really long chapter, um, and I think it's gonna be really easy to uh, to miss out on some things. Here we go. Got him. What I get there? Damn, really? Oh, damn. All right, whatever. Uh. This verse is so weird. You, you can't fight this thing. You have to, like, run to the end of the hallway and then just fight these angels instead. It's just... It's so confusing. All right. Like, the verse begins as soon as it, like, starts attacking you, but it really doesn't matter. Just just beat the shit out of it. Just run down the hallway and then... Uh, here we go. Fuck. Got it. Okay, how'd that go? I got hit once, so I don't think I platinumed it, but... Oh, I did. Okay. I would have pure platinumed it if I didn't get hit. Alright. Uh, verse 8. How do you do this? Run up the stairs on the next level. Keep going until temperance breaks on the wall. Yeah, so you, 
So this is one of the annoying parts. Uh, he comes up here. Uh, what, what? Hang on. Oh, is it not here? Yeah, is it up ahead? Here he goes. Okay. Yeah, not a fan of this segment, like, at all. Like, it's kind of gimmicky. It's one of those examples of a... Yeah, if I do get a bad score, I think I will go ahead and reload it. Um, let's see. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, did I really get hit? What the fuck? All right, uh... I think that's the way you do it. You uh, just trigger the witch time and then keep firing at him. I get hit? Oh, no, I didn't. I dodged that somehow. I'm not a fan of that encounter at all. Alright, uh... Gold, uh, yeah, I think it's acceptable. I shouldn't have taken so many hits, but I'm doing really well, all things considering. Uh, yeah, so you're supposed to backtrack. Uh, you know, that, that's the thing I hate about this uh, the Alpine portals. Like, you have to backtrack, and like after after chapters, it's just it, it's just boring. It's stupid. It's a uh, it's pointless. It's just like okay. Like, I don't like how it contributes to your overall score. I just don't. Uh, all right, let's see here. Gotta love that you're fighting all these angels with all these people around you. I mean, it's kind of it's kind of cool, but uh. like it kind of has that Harry Potter feeling of like thing is just happening all around you. There we go. Wait, what? Oh, is it? What the fuck was that? Wait. I don't think I've ever been back here. What the fuck? Yep, I got uh, another witch heart. Awesome. Shit, that's not even all the treasure. There's still more hidden treasures in this game. Like, what the fuck? There can't be that many more, but I still don't have the achievement for getting all of them. Uh, Alright, let's see. What is this one? This might be the last I'll find, but... I mean, there might be another one. Let's see. Which time disabled? Defeat all the angels before time expired. Yeah, yeah, okay. Ah, oh, damn it! And, and they're fire ones? Okay, whatever. Bullshit. Hang on. Hang on. Uh, yeah, we are cheating. Yeah, okay. So, so the thing about this is... Um, this thing... The, 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 uh, the downside to using this thing is that it's... Uh, it, dis it technically disables Witch Time, but in situations like this, where Witch Time is disabled anyway, it actually becomes super, super OP, so... Um, like, I'm told a lot of players use this on uh, Infinite Climax. I personally don't. I prefer the Moon of Makala, but that's just me. Oh, it's still equipped it, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. I hate the fire. I just hate the fire. All right. Let's see. Hang on. Let me just. Oh, fuck. I pressed it. I pressed the button. Oh. Piece of shit. Hang on, yeah. 
I think my combo score is gonna go to shit though because of all the all the shit I pulled. Oh fuck. Okay, ridiculous. Why? <laughs> I hate fire enemies. They're such a gimmick. All right, especially with like which time disabled. What's the deal with that anyway? There's probably an easier way to deal with these things, but um. Oh, but he dropped. He dropped right in front of me where I was about to attack. All right. How could I have seen that coming? All right. Ah, uh, let's see. You piece of shit. All right. Oh, fuck. Yeah, just dodge them when they get too close, and then uh, unleash the evil rosary. Oh, fuck, they're everywhere. All right. Hang on, let me... I'll torture attack you, because you're a bitch. Explode that. Yeah, they're... the explosions are really powerful. They tend to send them flying. The bigger ones, not so much, but eh, it's not a big deal. Yeah, you piece of shit. All right. Oh, what? Yeah, I thought that would be enough. Here we go, you piece of shit. Okay, how did, how'd that go? Oh, fuck. More of them? Oh, okay. At least these guys aren't, aren't on fire. That's good, right? Oh, fuck. Oh, they are on fire. Wait. But they're not surrounded by fire, so it's not... It's not the same? Wait, okay, here we go. Yep, got him. And these guys aren't completely surrounded by fire, so it's not nearly as obnoxious. Alright, uh, let's break dance. Everything I've been getting is a moon, is a heart piece. Do they not have, like, uh, moon pearls in this? Oh, no! Okay, oh, not great, but oh well. Yeah, I think there are, there can only be, like, two more, seven more heart pieces in the entire game, so. We're near the end, alright. Alright, that was bullshit, though. That was... <sighs> I hate those challenges. I hate them. But you have to do them. Uh... Don't tell me there's another treasure chest back there, but... <gasps> anyway. Um... Let's go up. I mean, it's kind of cool running through this big tower. I, I really I really enjoy it. It's that... Again, like, I'm at... It's one of the cool things about Bayonetta. It's able to make this uh, very generic area, like a tower, look really cool and unique in its own way. Um, and of course, there's a plot twist near the end. It, it's ridiculous. Hang on. How do you... Oh, hang on. <sighs> well, not really a plot twist, but uh, this isn't really a tower. <laughs> um, I, I mean, you see the goddess statue, and it's just like, yeah, this is this is great. Uh, is it supposed to be Jubileus? I mean, I, it doesn't resemble her at all, but okay. I mean, I would buy it, but... It doesn't feel like Cereza's here either. Alright, whatever. Here we go. Wait, shit. Ah, damn. Yeah, imagine if I got killed by an elevator. That would be lame. Uh, yep, verse 10. Is there anything here, or do you just climb up the elevator? Here we go, you piece of shit. Gotta love how they uh, reuse the bosses in this. Hang on. I forgot to unequip the uh, thingy. Uh, let me see here. Why am I not getting witch time off of it? Like, that is my pet peeve when I can't get witch time off of things I should be getting witch time off of. Alright. It's not like I'm playing on Infinite Climax or anything, but... Yeah, I fucked, it. I fucked this one up a lot. I screwed the pooch here. Uh, yep. Yeah, I, I got hit too many times. Um, yeah, I did too well. Yeah, yeah, let's... Uh, let's restart that. That's... Uh, how should I approach that one? Snap! 
No, FNAF is shit. Like, FNAF is complete shit. Like, legit, probably one of the worst things ever made. To be fair, I, I mean, yeah, I mean... Like, YouTube has been a bad thing for gaming in general. Oh, here we go. That's what we should do. We should use the, uh... We should use the Bazillions. Yeah, FNAF has been, like, the worst thing to ever happen for gaming, ever. Um, of course, like, it's not just me saying that. Like, anyone who actually plays video games will tell you that, but... Oh, fuck. Here we go. Yeah, stay still and let me kill you. Here we go. Hopefully the, uh, the dodging is enough. I'm not even hitting it. What the fuck? All right. You piece of shit. All right. What a piece of shit. All right. Oh, here we go. Now, now we've run along it. Man, I... Oh, wait. Oh, I didn't unequip it again. Oh, hang on. Shit. Yeah, I do kind of hate, like, switching out items for specific situations. It's, it's kind of time-consuming. I mean, I understand why it's necessary, but it's like, eh. Alright, here we go. Okay, let's see if how I did there. I mean, my damage score was fine, but uh, I'm kind of worried about my combo because of the stupid shit I was pulling. Well, I couldn't hit him. That's the thing. Like, the way he was angled, it was like, my combo attacks were just missing. So I was just like, okay, I'm just going to shoot him. All right, uh, how'd that go? Damn, look at that garbage combo score. Holy shit. Um, I mean, yeah, I got two silvers, but I've mostly got platinums. I think I might be fine. I think. Um, so where's the next, where's the next verse? Oh, here. I don't, is it just me, or does that look kind of like... I don't know. It's just my imagination, but it looks like Politana from Kid Icarus. Uh, maybe it's just my uh, Nintendo fanboys I'm showing. And I guess it is supposed to be, like, sort of a Greek or thing. Right, here we go. What's in here? Holy shit, I never opened that? What the fuck? Well, anyway. Um, I, so, <laughs> uh, there are chests lying around, Chapter 15, that I've never opened. Uh, okay. Is there another one over there? Here we go. Knew it. Next verse hasn't started yet. The next verse hasn't started yet. Uh. Yeah, they're so slow on normal. It's like really difficult to even hit them. All right. Verse 11. Here we go. All right, you piece of shit. Yeah, once you get a good few good hits in, uh, you can you can whittle them down and then just awesome. Platinum. Yep, yep. Okay, so my general enemy encounters are going pretty well, but there are a couple of ones that are just what the fuck? Is that a red hot needle? What the fuck? All right. So wait, where's verse 12? Move along the circular platform until you come to a large ornate circle surrounded by gold. Which walk up the golden strip? I guess this is it. And then activate the mechanism. Alright. If you say so, I better not be getting tricked. But... Yeah, I'm, I'm paranoid I might miss a verse, cause, uh, so I'm, I'm reading like every step of the way.
Oh, whoops, what the fuck? Oh, okay, whoops. Oh, fuck. That's right, I remember where this is. Uh... Wait, where is the... Oh, is it on the other one? Because I remember this very well. I remember doing this before. Ah, shit. I think this is around the point I uh, stopped playing this on the, uh, the Wii U version. Because I really don't... Again, like, I don't think the, le the last half of the game is as well designed as the first half. So here we go. Uh, here we go. Shit. I mean, look at this. It's just... Alright, here we go. Bullshit. Wait. Ah, right, here we go. Oh, again? Ah, right, here we go. Fucking really? Again with the fire and the... Okay. Is that all of them? Uh... Wait, where's the rest of the angels? Wait, where'd they all go? Oh, oh, do you have to get the other one, the other side too? Hang on. What? What? Huh? Wait, what the fuck? Wait, huh? Wait. Uh... I'm getting kind of confused. So don't tell me you have to. Uh... What the fuck did I do here? Wait. Where are the other angels? Wait. I have uh, angels to kill. Why isn't the first I did? Uh... Yeah, I might have to reset at this rate. Uh, I'm not tolerating a bronze or anything like that. I don't think I want another silver, to be honest with you. Oh, wait. Here it is. What the fuck? Okay. How bad is that? Oh, did I knock him off the edge or something stupid like that? That might explain it. Okay, here we go. How the fuck was that a platinum? Like, I swear I only... <laughs> the damage was a gold? Like, what? Because of that thing I did at the end where I got hit by the fire, which is uh, complete bullshit. Okay, uh... Yeah, I'm not a fan of these squares. It's just... It's just dumb. Alright. Again, not my favorite. Moment and Bayonetta. Here we go. Yeah, I remember getting this for the uh, last time I played it. Alright. There was a moon pearl in here. Alright, here we go. Uh... Wait, is that enough? What the fuck? Wait. Where did that thing come from? Alright. I don't think I ever got this one. Yeah, I guess I'm paying more attention this time. Uh, instead of just wandering from fight to fight. Uh, nope, I did get it. Alright. Uh, Alright, where's my next objective? Uh, over here? <laughs> is this the only area where the crow is actually useful? Uh, here we go. Yep, here he comes. Okay, this shouldn't be too difficult. I mean, I fought this thing before. I wonder if it just has different transformations in this one. It does feel a little bit faster, I think. Maybe it's in my imagination. Oh, I don't remember that thing, so... Fuck! Hang on. Yeah, I'm getting hit by things that aren't attacks. Like, stop it. Alright. Alright, you piece of shit. Alright. That's a that's an attack. Like spinning around in a circle is not an attack. All right. Okay, let's see how I did there. Honestly, like I think I did well enough to do it. Like there's so many verses in this. I Was that the end of it? I think that is the last verse. Oh, nope. There's one more verse after this, yeah. All right. They really do just... <laughs> they miss it twice. I, I think they finally nail it in Bayonetta 2. That's a joke that I don't think anybody picked up on. Like, they finally nail it in Bayonetta 2. But Bayonetta 2 is so awful, it just doesn't do it for me. Well, I'm exaggerating how bad Bayonetta 2 is. But... 
Ah, damn it. Yeah, I could have done a lot better than that. Uh, so I got three silvers. I mean, with how well I've done so far, I think I'll be fine. But, I mean, I'll be pissed if not. I mean, I guess I could just do it again. It's not too hard. But this wasn't too hard, honestly. Like, the main thing was, like, the, the Alfheim, I think. And it usually is the Alfheim. Like, the Alfheim is, like, the source of all of my suffering in the world. All right. Yep, here we go. Yeah, I love how um, creative the... Uh, I love how creative these things are. Yeah, normal is starting to reach the point where it's getting a bit too easy, honestly. I'll be uh, really excited to reach hard. Oh, shit. I completely forgot about this. Uh, run faster, Bayonetta! I am shocked that the... Okay. I am shocked that the panther was not just... Come on! A gold? Ah, uh, whatever. Good enough. And I think there's another Alfheim up here, if I'm remembering correctly. Uh, let me see here. I thought there was one. Like, I thought you, like... No? Is there really nothing else up here? No, I guess not. I thought there was uh, something you could walk on. No, I, mean, I don't see anything about it in the in the guide, so I guess we're good. Uh, I love this. This is so epic. This is so cool. Then he has an office up here. It's so it's so nice. Okay, what do we get? What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No! Ah, oh, fuck. Fuck, I knew I should have reset. I knew it. Oh, damn. We were so close to Venom. Okay. Well, to be fair, that's, uh, that's, that's still way better than my last score, but... Damn. That was so close. We were so close. Ugh. So even, like, a couple of silvers are, like, unacceptable. You have to get, like, golds or platinums on everything. Like... Otherwise, it's going to bog your score down. It's just... Uh, just unbelievable, dude. Unbelievable. I was so close. I was so close to doing it, dude. All right. All right. Um, so I just got to not get silvers this time. Uh, should I do it again, or should I move on to Balder? I might as well do Balder, right? And try to try to get that. Try to get that done. Try to platinum that. Because it, it's a really easy boss fight. Actually, I might as well check... Um, Rodan and see if I have everything I need. If he's gotten, if he has any more stuff for me. Yeah, whatever. Weapons. Uh, yeah, I think I have everything. What else is there? Like, I feel like I have everything in the game. All right, I've had everything in the game for a while, but. Yeah, I don't know how to unlock anything else. Uh, yeah, I'm at the point now where I have literally everything. I, I think there's, like, some secret stuff. Um, yeah, I'll have, to, I'll have to look up what what else I... I what else there is, but alright. So, the final chapter. Yeah, Baldur is not a hard boss fight at all. It's actually kind of disappointingly easy, so... So I think I'm going to do this real quick and then go back and do 15. Like, I'm sure, like, the, my big thing about this fight is that I... You know, what I... Yeah, this is definitely one of the, uh... I, I definitely see this boss as kind of a disappointment. Not as much as the one in Bayonetta 2, but, like... I hate how this motherfucker, like, hypes himself up as, like... This villain that Bayonetta can't beat. He's just too powerful. And then, like... And then, like, oh, you beat him, like, out of nowhere. Shit. Wait, did I already beat him? Like, wait. Is it all you have to do, or does he? Is his life bar reset? Oh yeah, that's right. He does the uh, the climax thing. Okay. Yeah, you whip out your demons, and he doesn't give a fuck because he's a lumen sage. He fights demons, like. Okay. He eats demons for breakfast, so like nothing he does, nothing you do can really uh, hurt him at all, which is awesome. And then you just suddenly beat him like out of nowhere. 
it's such a disappointment. Like, uh, apparently the fight was supposed to be much harder, but they uh, they changed it because it was too hard. I think that's kind of how Rodan came about, the, the secret boss. Like, apparently that's just the original Balder, just um, just non-casualized. So I'm kind of anxious to actually experience that. Oops, here we go. Apparently, that's what I've been told. I actually know very little about it. I've seen, like, images of it, but... Here we go. I don't get why Rodan is the final boss of both... The secret final boss of both Bayonetta 1 and 2. Like, come on. Do something different. Like, 2 does not... Dude, 2 doesn't feel like it takes, takes any risk. It really doesn't. Like, they kill off Jean, it never really feels like she's gone for good. Here we go. Oh, fuck! Oh, come on! I pressed the button! Alright. Alright, I failed. I thought it was, like, the jump button, but, like, okay, I... I was like, wait a minute, is, the, is it the X and Y thing? But, yeah, it was, so, like, okay. Yeah, I gotta take that hit. There's nothing I can do except do my best. Oh, here we go. He's gonna drop the, uh... Yeah, the beam. This could have been such a good boss fight, but... Oops, here we go. I mean, I guess it's still pretty solid. Like, it's different than the others, right? But... But yeah, I just don't like the way it ends, I, th I would say. It, it almost feels like a Bayonetta 2 boss fight, honestly. Like, maybe not that bad, but it, I mean, it feels like the same kind of idea. Where you're like, you know... Um, yeah, like, like I said before, I, I'm not a fan of the way Bayonetta handles its boss fights at all. Like, enemies feel, like, way more predictable in that game. I don't know what it is. Um, I haven't played Bayonetta 2 in forever. Here we go. Yeah, talk about, like, uh, <laughs> talking about, about, uh, rebelling against daddy. Shit. I don't know, Baldur could have been, like, a really interesting character, but he's not. Like, I, I just don't feel the character is really that, that interesting. Again, the entire story is kind of garbage, but... Baldur himself, like, I, I don't know. It, his evil plan makes no sense. His backstory makes no sense. It's just... It's like, did, did the villain really have to be her father? Like, really? Just, just... Honestly, like, I kind of wish Bayonetta's, like, past was a mystery. Because I honestly kind of ignore it half the time. I kind of like... I kind of like just, you know, imagining it. Like, I kind of like how a lot of her, um... A lot of the stuff she does outside the game is kind of a mystery. Here we go. It's all like Samus Aaron in that in that regard. Oops, here we go. Like, that's one of the reasons I'm so against, like, a Bayonetta having a love interest, like, ever. Like, I don't, like, just let people, like, imagine for themselves, like, shit. Like, that's what makes the character fun. Like, uh, like I, I legit think that having a love interest would, like, ruin Bayonetta. Like, I really do. Right, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love this shit. Uh, man, she's a strong girl. All right. I kind of wish the buttons changed to like make it di more difficult, but uh, I mean, I, I guess that would be too fast. Here we go. Uh, ah, damn. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting destroyed out here. Uh... Yeah, I wonder what I'm going to get here. Probably a gold. I... No, I, I've taken too many hits. Uh, I, I think a silver at this rate. I don't know, man. Is it possible to get lower than a silver? I, I think... If you, like, have a good combo and, uh, time. Because my combo and time is fine. It's always just the damage for me, personally. Okay, so what you have to do... I take this, you piece of shit. 
right, let's see what we got. What'd we get? A silver? Yeah, compared to... Aw, oh, damn, yeah, it's my damage. So my combo is fine, my time is dying, but yeah, I'm getting... When you get, like, a fucking silver... <laughs> when you get a silver for that shit, yeah, that's not good. Um... Alright, so, um... Platinum. Have I really been playing this for an hour and a half just of this? Wow. I mean, it's a great game, but yeah, there's, there's a... I've put so much time into this, dude. Um, doing this fucking challenge. Getting every platinum and normal. Like, shit. Do I, do I need to do it with all of them or just normal? I think you only need to do it once, but, but I probably will end up doing it with all for all of them eventually. I, I don't know. I, I don't think it's necessary. I think it is just get 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 them all in normal and you unlock something. Uh, here we go. Epilogue. I love how it presents it like that was the end. Epilogue. Uh, so we just we just see the uh, the final chapter. No. All right. I, I think I am gonna do this again and try to platinum it. Uh, let's let's see that. One more time, and I think I might play something else. Uh, does anybody want to watch me play Link's Awakening? Or is everybody just wanting me to play Bayonetta forever? Just, alright. I think, uh... I think I gotta dodge his attacks more often. Oh, fuck! Oh, there we go. Yeah, do we have to just stay away from him when he's not... Here we go. Oh, fuck! Okay. Yeah, when he flies away, I think you should just not try to hit him. I should try... Here we go. Fuck. There we go. I think we got it. Okay. Like, you have to do this, like, three times, right? And then you have the ending. So, I, I guess his phases are slightly different. Because he uses different moves, right? He doesn't do, like... He does, he's not, like, really aggressive right away. He's just fucking with you to start with. Oh, here we go. Well, I, I guess you could argue he's fucking with you the entire way, but... Here we go. Yep, got him. Whoa, that was an easy boss fight. Why does it sound like an elephant? Uh, Alright, uh... Yeah, I'm so hyped for Bayonetta 3, dude, but... Unfortunately, it feels like... Oof. Hopefully, we'll get another, um... A partnership... We'll get another Direct next month. Uh, that shows off more games from 2021. I'm sure Bayonetta 3 is gonna be a 2021 game. It feels like it's gonna come out of nowhere at this rate. The way rate they're going. And I hope it's great. I hope it, like, it's a good way to cap off the trilogy. I don't think there's going to be a Bayonetta 4, I really don't. Oops, but... Oops. He doesn't really need to go on forever. Like, honestly, like, I kind of feel like Bayonetta 2 was completely unnecessary. Like, yeah, I was hyped for it, like, when it was announced, but that was assuming, like, it would be as good as the original, and it wasn't. And uh, I'm kind of worried that Bayonetta 3 is going to kind of be in the same boat. Oh, here we go. Yeah, uh, dodge... Aw, oh, she just shrugged. Aw. Damn, badass. Wait, what did she do? Does she kick it? Oh, she just headbutts it. What the fuck? Alright. Hardcore Bayonetta. Alright. Daddy's so proud of you, Bayo. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, Cereza. My dear, sweet child. Oh, here we go. Like I said, it's not a hard fight. It really isn't. Here we go. Fuck. Wait, what? There we go. Shit. There we go. Get over here. Oh, fuck. Oh, there we go. Okay, I think we got it. Oh, fuck. Damn. All right. No, got him. All right. That should do it. All right. Wait for which time to end, then climax. All right. Yeah, doing this on Infinite Climax must be, like, crazy hard. Um, I can't even get Platinums on Normal yet. I mean, consistently. I mean, I, I guess I'm getting there, but... I don't know. I, I guess part of the problem with doing it on Normal is that, like, your uh, your damage score is so much lower because you're not making as many points because the enemies aren't as hard. I think on, like, Hard, it's actually kind of easier because, because the enemies are more, like, there. You know what I mean? 
Like, you can just uh, let loose with your craziest combos. Here we go. Alright, so I think one more and we're good. So I think my damage score is fine for now, but let's see. Oops. Oh shit, he got me! Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure how that went. Oh, fuck. Yeah, okay. Okay, he gets a lot more aggressive in phase three, okay. Oh, fuck. There we go, got him. I think that's it. Dang. The Moon of Mahakala is so good. I cannot emphasize that enough. Okay, we got him. We got him. Okay. I think that's good enough. I think we did a good enough job. As long as we don't fuck up this uh this final shot. Alright. Which to be fair is kind of ridiculous. I think it only matters if you hit the last one. Uh Okay, that should have been a pure platinum, but I got hit, like, a couple of times, so I think that... I think that might fuck me up. Okay, come on, what is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? I can't imagine playing much better than that. Oh, we did it. Oh, if we didn't get hit. If we didn't get hit, we would have a pure platinum. All right. Um, should I do Jubileus now, or should I wait a little bit? Chapter 15 is really obnoxious, so I think I, I, think I do want to go on to Jubileus and try my hand at that. Uh, do you want to see Jubileus? Uh, may the crater Jubileus grace you. Grace you. Um, yeah, really, really enjoying this. Uh, again, this is... You know, I, I own this game before, on, on, like, other platforms, right? Like, I own it on other games other than Switch. And this is still one of my most played games. Okay, this is still one of my most frequently uh, popped-in games on Switch. Because it's just that good. Like, this really is a 10 out of 10 game. Um, you know, one of my all-time favorites, for sure. It's been enough time now where I can say, like, yeah, this is probably one of my favorite games ever. Um, all right. Uh, Epilogue Requiem. Let's look at my, uh, my play history. Look at that. Isn't that normal bar uh, beautiful? Like, ignore the hard and infinite climax ones. But the, <laughs> the normal one is beautiful. Holy crap. Okay, so once we, get, once we get the epilogue, we are set. All right. Once we get the epilogue, chapter 15... And chapter 15 is perfectly doable. I just didn't do it last time. All right. Okay, let's... I get the impression this is going to be hard as fuck, but we'll, we'll see. Uh... Yeah, this one isn't nearly as annoying as, like, Route 666, but we'll see. Uh... Ah, fuck. Wait, what was that? All right. I don't get where Jean goes after you get to the top. Like, Bayonetta just kind of fights Jubileus on her own. It just, it's just kind of... Okay, is that a silver? Okay, uh... Yeah, so this has multiple verses to it, which I think is the the thing I have a problem with with it. Like, I just... It gives you... Okay, it doesn't even give you time to, like, consider what you could have done better. Like, it just... Uh... I don't know. I, I find this final boss kind of overrated, honestly. Like, I don't know. That was just kind of my impression. I, I like Rintilda a lot more. I like. There, there's a lot of bo game bosses I like a lot more than this, but uh, I mean, I, I can see. I mean, I can sort of see why people love it so much, but I don't know. Let's see, yep, that's a gold. All right, so a silver and a gold, and then you have. So I think. Okay, I, I want to go through this and see like master all the other things, so I'm probably not going to get it right away, but we'll see. I mean, I got gold last time I did it, so... Wait, what? Huh? Shit, what the fuck is this? Why did time slow down? Alright. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's it. You jump. How many verses are there? Okay. Does the verse end when you... No. Okay. So, get this. You ride a motorcycle into space. And... <laughs> okay. Yeah, platinum. Awesome. So do you even need to hit anything? It almost feels like you're not supposed to. Um, let, let's see. So get this, we're climbing into space. Alright. Here we go. Uh, skip the cutscene. Oh, whoops. Oh, shit! What? Fuck! No! Wait! Shit! Okay. Bullshit. Alright. Uh, that was not what I was... <laughs> that was not what I meant to do. Uh...
Yeah, that's it. That's a uh, gold. Okay, yeah, I, I can see why a lot of people like this. I mean, I personally don't care for it that much. Like, I personally think it could have been a lot better, but I will. Oh, and you go over a chest. Aw. Oh. Okay, here we go. Yep, we're at the top. Okay, so, yeah, so there's six verses in this. Oh, no, you have the... Uh, I think you have, like, the uh, the epilogue, too. Like, the, uh, the, the credit sequences. Which is obnoxious in and of itself. All right. Okay, so yeah, this is the final boss of Bayonetta, uh, uh, literally God, or Jubileus. I don't know, Bayonetta lore is, like, so ridiculous, because, like, you kill, okay, you kill, you kill this thing, and then you kill, like, another god, like, who's apparently, like, the god of the human world or some shit, so, like, what, what's three gonna be about? Like, are you taking on Inferno? Like, I, I don't, I don't get it, like, Bayonetta lore makes no sense, it, it really doesn't, like, I, I, I'm a big fan, right, uh, you, you won't find a bigger fan than me, um, you know, but the lore is just so stupid, like, Fuck, wait. Like, you can look at the notes, but it's just... You know what? Maybe I should, like, just go over the notes. Like, go over, like, the art book, in-game in art book or whatever. Go over, like, the designs of the characters and go over some, like, deep lore stuff. Uh, yeah, you know, that might actually be fun. Uh, remind me to do that sometime um, and talk about how dumb the lore is. It's honestly not even worth following a lot of times. I mean, there, there's some interesting tidbits, like, oh, uh, Dante's mother Eva is uh, mentioned in this, but um, other than that... Honestly, like, I want to say, like, Devil May Cry might actually have more interesting lore. I don't know. Uh, maybe I'm talking out my ass. I, I think the fanboys and, like, their, their incessant talking about, like, DMC being so good is getting to me. I, I didn't care for it. Oops, there we go. Shit. Oh, I'm using ice skates. Oh, in the ice area. That's hilarious. Oh, shit. Okay, like, the the, the, the 2D, like, flat paper bayonetta thing is really weird. Alright, but uh, anyway. Uh, whoop, fuck. Ah, shit. Ah, oh, here we go. Wait, where the fuck is everyone. Oh, here we go. Uh, yeah, where's the last one? Alright, here it is. Alright, that's her. Alright, so two more to go. Yeah, I think this took me forever when I was, uh, first learning how to do it, but now I've, uh, I'm getting to the point where I can sort of breeze through it, so I think it's a bit more entertaining this way. Uh, here we go. There we go. Yeah, she's whipping out all these things and can't quite stand up to me. She's not powerful enough. Here we go. Where's the... Where's the platform? Shit, hang on. Alright, here we go. Oh, what the fuck? Wait, why'd I go the wrong way? Alright. I don't... I, it's very difficult, I think, for people to... To be fans of both Devil May Cry and this, and not consider them to be part of the same universe. Like, I don't know, like, that, that's kind of the impression I got. Like, I think even the creators of this are just like, okay, this totally takes place in Devil May Cry. Honestly, like, this feels more like Devil May Cry than, uh, I think 5 does. 5, like, feels super, super off-key. I, I, I don't know, like, the way, I don't know. Devil May Cry's fans will never admit it, but, uh, I don't know, 5 feels really rehashed. Uh, but anyway. Like, oh no, it's like Dante and Virgil again? Like, how, <laughs> like, shit, alright. 
You, you can't, like... Double May Cry fans have not been able to convince me that anybody likes Nero. Like, they're just in denial about that. Like, Nero sucks. I mean, I mean, I guess all the characters suck, but I don't know. Oops, here we go. Shit, here we go. Oh, fuck, yeah. One hit KO. Like, all the shit I did might be worthless if I get thrown out into space. Alright, here we go. Uh, where is she? Right, here we go. You bitch, alright. I've heard people say these are supposed to be galaxies, but I, I have no, I have no fucking clue. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? Right, here we go. Alright, here we go. Yeah, I think I am gonna be able to platinum this, platinum this tonight. Um, I mean, I, I could do it, but it's like, eh, maybe I want want to do something else. Honestly, like, it says a lot about this game that I'm still playing it, like, incessantly this long. Here we go. Wow, that's it. Yeah, the boss is, like, too short and easy. Like, I mean, not not too short and easy. I, I guess the build-up I'm throwing attached to, but the fight itself is just like, oh, just dodge the attacks. Oops. Oh, shit. I dodged that. Fuck you. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. Got it, bitch. And one final dance. Aw, oh, damn. Look at that outfit. Shit, look at those legs. Alright, fuck. And there she goes. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, so if anybody knows any uh, Bayonetta cosplayers, could you uh, get in touch with me? Thank you. Any good Bayonetta cosplayers, I should say. Uh... Alright, let's see if we can do this. I, I think I did pretty well this play this uh this playthrough. I honestly like I think the big thing for me right now is the uh is the um is the build up. Like all the other verses in this boss fight. Like the boss fight itself goes well, it's just like I, I don't know, how do you max out the uh, how do you get pure platinums on the on the build-up sections, I don't know. I just it, it just confuses me. Oh, I guess you can equip the gaze of despair. That's, that's probably it. All right, that's probably all you have to do. Okay. Yeah, it's so easy to slam into these fucking planets, dude. It, was this made before Pluto was declassified? Do you go by Pluto? Yeah, there's Saturn. You can tell it's Saturn because of the rings. Uh. uh Oh shit, 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 no! Fuck! How are you- <sighs> Fuck! Every single time! Do you have to- How do you do this? Uh, do you have to recenter yourself so you can see the planet coming? Like, I... Okay, it's the fucking- Okay, how is it that every single planet in the solar system is perfectly aligned during this epic battle? Like, <sighs> Damn. Fuck, this completely fucked me up. Okay. Damn, that was awful. Alright. Do you have to, like, recenter it? Like, okay. Yeah, you got. Okay, they're gonna come at you one at a time, obviously. These planets seem way too fucking. way too fucking close together. Not to mention weirdly proportioned. Like, Jupiter doesn't look much bigger than the others. Like, alright. Okay, so that's the outer ring. Um, I can't believe we hit a fucking planet. Like, how do you do that? Like, how did we get so far out anyway? Like, how did we get out? How did? How the fuck did we get out that far past Earth? It's just all right. Hey, look, it's our planet. Hey, buddy. Uh, beautiful as always. Mother Earth. All right, here we got shit. Uh, Venus, Mercury. I cannot believe I got hit. Alright. Yeah, I need to learn more about the planets. It's been a long time. I don't think I've learned about them at all since I was a kid. 
Alright, let's, uh, I cannot believe I fucked that up. I cannot believe I fucked that up. A silver? Oh, come the fuck on. Bullshit. Alright. Bullshit. Anyway, yeah, this is definitely not a platinum. I don't even think I got a gold because of the death I had to go through. It sounds like something out of Kingdom Hearts. Like, very Kingdom Heartsy soundtrack. At least the beginning of it. So you throw it to the sun and it's still gonna, like, come down to Earth? Like, how the fuck does that happen? It's not that big. Alright. Okay, well, whatever. Uh... Is that all of it? Gold? Oh, come on! Damn, okay, I am so angry. Yeah, I, I think it's time for a break. Next time. Yeah, that was, uh... <laughs> that was disappointing. Oh, I really thought I would be able to pull off a platinum, but no, I, I fucked it up. Alright. Now we gotta go through the ending credits that I, I don't wanna sit through. Yeah, you have to watch the credits, or play through the credits. Which makes, like, doing the boss fight, like, even more ridiculous, because it's like, okay. Director Hideki Kamiya. Hey, it's, uh, your second to last good game. Producer Yusuke Hazamoto. Yeah, yeah. I, oh, yeah, by the way, I can confirm. I can confirm. Kamiya has blocked me on Twitter, so, uh, fuck him. Uh, I don't know, making fun of Kamiya is just, I don't know, a thing, you know what I mean? Uh... Wait a minute. It can be Nakamura. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What the fuck? What is Ikimi Nakamura doing on these credits? Fuck, she was she worked on Bayonetta. I didn't know that. Shit. All right. So, she does have a pedigree. I thought like for the longest time she was like just Shinji Mikami is like waifu. Oh, right, here we go. Yeah, I had no idea she worked on this game. All right. Mary Shinazaki. Why the fuck did um, Hideki Kamiya make a big deal about her showing up the Platinum Games? Like, I don't know. The way they acted, it was like they never met. Like, it was just... I don't know. I don't know. Like, Nakamura... I don't know. I'm always going to be angry at her for, like... Uh, I don't know. I don't want to say whoring herself out, but... Uh, I don't know. Just that entire event. It, it was just... Uh, E3, Tokyo Ghostwire... Like, that was just a very good example of everything that's wrong with the gaming community. Like, why the fuck did people get excited at a woman working on a video game? Like, who cares? Like, like I don't I don't understand the appeal at all. I was very, very critical. Like, people were serious... Yeah, how old is she? She has to be, like, almost 40, right? Oh, she had a baby recently, so... Uh, uh, how old is she? If she worked on Bayonetta, I mean, I guess she could be fairly young, but... This could have been one of her first games, but we'll, we'll see. Um... Uh, I don't know, I don't know anything about her. I just know, like, a bunch of, like, thirsty fucks came out and were just, like, lusting after this woman just for, I don't know, being... I don't know, a woman in games, I guess. It was, it was weird. So I, I think you might be able to eke out a, a Platinum if you, uh... If you do well on these things, uh... So you can't put down the controller, you just can't skip the credits. Like, every time you play, you're gonna have to... Yeah, verse 10. And it's gonna be so satisfying when you have this thing, uh... When I have this thing unlocked. I, I don't remember how you unlock it, but... Like, you do get, like, um... Infinite Climax. Story writing, Hideki Kamiya. Oh, yeah, your garbage-ass story. English adaption, J.P. Kellums. Oh, that cuck who left Platinum for EA. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I love this game, but I can't help but make fun of the people who, uh, who worked on it. Oh, pure Platinum. All right. Wait, did I get a pure Platinum trophy? Uh, that would be great. Oh, uh, yeah, I wouldn't mind watching this, but I don't think we need to. Oh, yeah, you can skip the pole dance, but not the actual... What the fuck? 
to me, I, I'm disappointed in you. I'm extremely disappointed in you. You piece of shit. Okay. Like, what the fuck, Kamiya, you piece of shit. Oh, yeah, and it's, uh, hilariously, this is just the Wii U version. I don't... Why are they crediting the voiceover again? Oh, whatever. Gotta love how, like, they didn't change it all. They didn't even change the text for the... Wait, what? How is there an optional verse for... Alright, whatever. So, the, the credit sequence is good. The credit sequence is easy. Uh, I just need to not suck. Um, with the boss itself, I think. How did I miss a verse? Like, w w what's the deal? Alright. Oh, did I miss an Alpine Mare, too? Congratulations, yeah, we beat the game. Uh, I guess. Oh, whoops. no, wait, hang on, shit. Uh, save data. How much time have I put into this shit? 37 hours? No, it's a lot more than that. Yep, 46 hours. 46 hours of this. Just, uh Wait, no, wait, no. Don't say, don't delete, don't delete the data. All right. 46 hours, like, amazing. Like, I, and I'm still playing. I'm probably going to play put it in, like, another, another 50 hours. I only put 60 into Bayonetta 2, and, uh, yeah, th this game is way better for sure. Alright, uh, yeah, I think I'm done with this for now. Um, great, great game, I, I can't recommend it enough, but, uh, yeah, what should I play now, guys? Um, I don't know, some Smash, maybe? Super Nintendo, I don't know, I don't think there's anything on the Super Nintendo I want to play. Uh, Super Mario All-Stars, maybe, um, Link's Awakening, I think, is what I wanted, wanted to stream. I, I guess I could go through a dungeon of that. Really quickly. Uh. Alright, Link's Awakening it is. Link's Wakey it is. Wakey Link. Right. So I've been playing Bayonetta pretty consistently. <laughs> For like 10 years, right? I, I own several versions of it. I, I've played through it a couple of times, but uh, now I'm going for like pure 100% completion, like getting all the achievements and everything like that. Eventually, I might go for like pure platinum, but that's probably going to be a thing I do when like, okay, I want to play the game again, but I have nothing else to do. So right now, I'm just like, I'm 50 hours into the game and still have not unlocked Ordon. It's uh, kind of remarkable. All right. Oh no, I forgot. I have to get the shovel. Uh, I don't have the money for it. Fuck. How do you get money in this game? I guess you could just steal the shovel, but... Eh. Stealing isn't right. Ah. Uh. I guess we're just gonna walk around like cutting grass trying to find rubies. Alright. I seriously beat two dungeons and only have like 148 rubies, really. Oh, well, 149. I guess I can just look around and see. Yeah, but I'm just gonna have to cut grass and grind for the money that I need to progress with the game. Uh, so frustrating. Anyway, so I guess I, I guess I'll try to beat the the dungeon here. I wonder how long that's gonna take. Probably half an hour. I can't imagine it taking too long. I am kind of getting tired though, and I do want to write again tonight. Um, I got some. I got a lot of work done on Rabbit Hole today, and I kind of want to get back to that. Honestly, like I was considering not streaming like just before I went on, but I was just like, eh, wh why not? Uh, I mean, I like doing it, it's just, and it, um, you know, it promotes my website, promotes my books, it's fine, um, oh wow, there's plenty of grass to cut.
Ah, damn. Yeah, Breath of the Wild was supposed to have the Minish in them, in it, so, uh, I wonder if they'll ever come back. I mean, I was thinking about, like, how I'm finding stuff in the grass, and I'm just like, oh, canonically, it's the Minish leaving stuff there. It's weird how that, that's a thing that's addressed in, like, one game. I don't think anybody really, um, really acknowledges that as canon, even though it probably is. I don't know, it's kind of interesting. All right. I mean, I think of it as canon, I just don't uh... Yeah, we can go right around. What the fuck was that? Alright. Alright. Yeah, I'm just collecting money, uh, just a little bit more. Yeah, 15 more. That wasn't too bad. That didn't take long at all. Like, I always think it's like it's gonna, get, gonna be a nightmare to do this, but it, it goes pretty quickly. Alright. It goes well. Alright. Two more, come on, that's all we need. Alright, here we go. 200. All we needed. Alright, time to buy the shovel and then uh, get off to Ed, um, what's his name? Richard's Villa. I almost said Edward. I was like, wait a minute, that's not right. It's, it's, not Edgar. It's Richard. Alright. Alright, here we go. Seems expensive? Oh, come the fuck on. You set the prices, you fuck. Alright. What a terrible, terrible person. Alright, let's get going. Okay, Mad Village. Duh. Alright, so let's go get the Golden Leaves. I, I think I got stuck here when I uh, did it last time, but let's see if we can get it. Let's see if we can get um, get all the Golden Leaves with no issues. Yeah, I remember doing it in the, uh, the Game Boy Advance version and not knowing where the last one was. Like, I don't know, you have to, like, bomb a wall or some shit, and it's not, like, really obvious in a, in that version of the game what you're supposed to do. It's, like, hidden. I, th I think in this one they, uh, they fixed it, so it's a bit more, uh, it's a bit more clear what you're supposed to do, but, uh, we'll see. Yeah, I, I really do, I really have, like, gone, gotten really, really attached to this art style, like, I think it's fantastic. Um, here we go, oops. Fuck. I love everything about the game. I love the, I love the area design. I love the uh, the combat, the enemies. Here we go. Oh, is this? Oh, do you have to get the monkey? Oh no. Yeah, you have to get him bananas. Fuck. Uh, hang on. I forgot about that. Uh, do I? What do I have? Wait. Do I have? Do I have any quest items? Oh, here we go. No, it's a key. Uh, power bracelet, sword shield. Yeah, what is your... Yeah, you need items in the trade quest. Um, damn, what I... Awkward. <laughs> it's kind of awkward that I don't remember uh, what comes first in the trade quest. All right. Um, yeah, there's lots of weird things like that you have to remember about this game. Uh, I mean, I, I remember where the bananas are, but I don't remember uh, what you need to get them. Yeah, it's dog food, right? Uh, so I think you get that from Madame Bow Wow. And uh, what what do you need to give her? It's a ribbon, right? Where do you get the ribbon? I, uh, okay. Uh, oh, is it from the Yoshi doll? You have to. Oh, okay. That, that's probably what I. That's probably what I did. I just didn't get the Yoshi doll like I was supposed to. Okay. Uh, oh, man, I love this game, but I, I'm already getting tired. I was not expecting to. Stay out of a dungeon this long. Yeah, I think I think I'm I am about ready to go to bed, or at least uh, work do something else. 
I think I'm done with streaming for now. Uh, such a shame. I really wanted to play this, but I'm, I'm getting a little bit tired. I mean, after Bayonetta, <laughs> like, who wouldn't be tired, right? Shit, all right. All right, four. I think it is just. Yeah, I think you need. You, you, yeah, you get the Yoshi doll, you give it to the kid. Do I have 10 rubies? I thought it was. Tw isn't it 20 in the original? Oh, whoops. Ah, oh, damn, what a piece of shit. All right. Okay, let's see. The buttons move the crane, the rest is just timing. Alright, uh... Move forward. Oh, fuck! I think I... I think I got it wrong. And I only had ten rubies. Oh, no. No, uh... All I needed was that Yoshi doll, and I completely failed. Well, to be fair, I would have plenty of rubies if I didn't... Yeah, okay. I don't have the rubies. Oh, shit. This is going to take a while just because I don't have the rubies. If I could just do it over and over and over again, I would be able to get it. But uh, I don't know where to get I don't know where to get rubies quickly in this game. I think you do just have to cut grass. To be fair, there's not a whole lot of instances where you need them. It's not like a link to the past where you need like uh, rubies for uh, you know the bot the big bomb or the uh, the flippers like I, I think you, there's only like one store in the game like this one if I'm remembering correctly. All right. Oh, I'm exhausted. Yeah, I'm getting really tired. <sighs> yeah, it's getting late too. Trendy game, one play, ten rubies. All right, the buttons move the crayon. The rest is up to you. Go to the buttons to play. Okay. Ah, uh, no! Shit! And you can only press it once? Ah, oh, fuck. Ah. Uh, I, I don't think I have this much, pro this much trouble with it in the... Uh, I don't think I have this 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 many this much problems with it in the uh, in the Game Boy version. I, I guess I'm not used to this version. I don't know. It's, it's just the light. It's the animation. All right. Am I making excuses? Maybe I am just tired. Right. I mean, I just platinum <laughs> chapter. I mean, I'm on. I just platinum chapter 14 in Bayonetta. So I'm, I'm not terrible at games, but. All right, all right. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Nope, I think that was a bit too... Okay, it, it's a little bit better. I mean, the light is somewhat on him. If you drop it! No, you piece of shit! Ah... Damn, I, I just want the Yoshi. All right. I want the Yoshi so I can give it to a kid so I can forget, proceed with the game. I just, ugh. Unbelievable. All right. Okay, let's try it again. The buttons move the crane. Go over to the buttons to play. All right. Okay, I think that's good. Wait, is that good or bad? I don't see the light on it. Did I go too far? But it looks like I'm right over it. You piece of shit! <sighs> what the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? All right. It just, 
it had a perfect grip on it and it just slipped out like like it was butter like shit that shopkeeper he's just fucking with me at this point like he had to have rigged that he's moving the yoshi back too like all right so i can't do it in one try all right what a piece of shit all right what a piece of cowabunga cowabunga dog shit all right All right. Come on. Come on, you piece of shit. Come on, grab it. Okay. It looks pretty safely snatched. It twitches around like a motherfucker, but I did get it. Okay. I did get the doll. Yeah, bitches love Yoshi dolls. They really do. Like, holy shit. You can't... <laughs> you got a Yoshi doll. You can't count how many games you've seen him in now. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, so we gotta go to this, this kid's mom and... And brag about my Yoshi doll. Actually, what actually happens is she gives you something. Yep, ribbon. How does this? I don't even remember how the quest, how the trading quest ends. It's just kind of, it's just kind of there. I don't know. It, it, it's necessary to progress, but I don't remember what you get at the end. I don't think it's anything valuable, but we'll see. Uh. And it's kind of nice that you can like explore and do things and. Uh, I don't get why this dog... And she's not talking anymore, either. You give her a ribbon, you give her some clothes, and she becomes a dog again. It doesn't make any sense. All right. Yeah, I think I am going to get my dog food and then scat, uh, skedaddle. I think I am done for the night. I'm, I'm completely burned out. Yeah, two hours a night is about as much as I can manage. And I think, like... I think I will start cutting back again. Uh, honestly, like... You know, with everything that's going on right now, with the book and stuff like that. Like, there are times where I'm just like, okay, maybe I shouldn't be streaming at all. I don't know. Just, all right. He eats the can, too. Like, what the fuck? All right. Da 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 da. Am I really going? Am I really going to the the castle? Am I really still playing this? Yeah, Bayonetta two. Right. Yeah, hopefully we hear more about Bayonetta two soon. I imagine it's gonna uh, Bayonetta three soon. I imagine it's gonna come out like next year. I, I can't imagine it being later than that. I don't get why it took so long. Like four two came out in like twenty fourteen. It's like if it comes out in twenty twenty one. That'll have taken like seven years to make. That's ridiculous. Like, come the fuck on. I just, eh. And it was now in like 2017. Like, come on. It, it has taken way too long to come out, I feel like. Pothole field. Alright. I think I'm just gonna get give the banana to the monkey and then just call it quits. I don't know. I, I really don't want to play level three right now. I, I think I will just um yeah, give the give the banana to the monkey and then just save it. Yeah, I don't think I can play anymore. Uh, all right. Yeah, thank you all for tuning in. Oh, oops. Oh, oops. Uh, give it to Kiki. 
But Kiki, I thought you liked rubies. All right. Oh, okay. Dup, but, 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 all right. Monkey business done. Bye bye. Okay. And then we never see the monkeys again. All right. Don't they like leave it on the bridge in the original? All right. Here we go. All right. I think that's everything I wanted. All right. I am set. All right. Uh, thank you 